In Microsoft Excel, whenever you use filters, let's say for this table, it actually brings these uh, uh, down arrow button, right? And you can, it's a drop down menu where you can select and, and do all kind of filtering. Now, it is very useful, but actually this, sometimes this button comes uh, in the way, right? And so in this video, we'll try to see how we can actually make this a little prettier. So when you present, it looks a little better and easier to read through. And so by default, of course, you cannot remove these, uh, these buttons right here whenever you set the filter, but we can do better. And so first of all, let's remove the filter and I'm going to insert a new row. Okay. And now I'm going to, going to set this filter using this empty row. Okay. So I'm going to select my data and now I'll set up a filter. And so now you can see uh, that it still has the same filter as it as before, but now it doesn't come on the way. So let's reduce the height of this row. And then what I can do is I can select the header uh, row and then let's just put it at a 45 angle, right? And so now I still have the same functionality, but my headers are cleaner uh, and then I still can enable the order filters. And so this is how you can easily uh, sort of hide your auto filter uh, down arrow buttons uh, to look at little better. So again, uh, I hope you like this little trick. If you did, please click on the like button. Uh, and if you like the content of this channel, then please consider subscribing. Thank you. Bye.